does the person you are with encourage you to read you have to ask what does he bring for me roses or books if someone has a stake in making you better that person will push you towards books books are what we all need socially we have been trained to visualize the happy family as the kid with his two arms being held by two people of opposite genders that's really not needed the kid is already being held in the palm of his real father hmm the real father is not even holding his arm he is holding the kid in his palm so if you are a single mother great now the question of the kid being 4 year old and you being needed to earn he is now fourth the troublesome period is behind you hmm? had he been one or two then the situation would have necessitated your constant physical presence near the kid he is 4 years old now you can have periods in the day when he can be left with the relatives with his grandparents or even in day care hmm? so get going with all sureness figure out a means of livelihood hmm? and don't look at your situation as if you are in a bind never ever think of yourself as if you lack in fortune you see look at the animal world how long does a cub stay with the lioness for how long for how long does the calf stay with the cow hmm please going by natural biology even human kids are not really required to stay tied to their mothers for 10 or 15 years it is just a social construct and it disables the kid the longer the mother remains tied to the kid the worse it is for the kid even in good old india kids would be sent off to a distant gurukul it was not a day school where the kid would return at 2 pm they would be sent off to a distant gurukul and then the parents would rarely have a look at them it was not encouraged at the age of 25 the fully developed young man or woman would then return to the household the 20 years of his stay with the guru 
was a period in which it was not considered proper that parents pay frequent visits. Parents should stay away in these 20 years. When he would be 25, he would come back. It's just that when you look at the people around and the families around and the apartments and the houses, you see even 30 years old clinging to their mothers. Like in Hindi movies. The 6 feet 2 inch Sunil Shetty comes and says, Ma, And you think that this must be the natural order of things. This huge fellow. And this is not only accepted but actually venerated. This is taken as strong family values. This is not family values. This is stickiness. I will venture to say this is hormonal imbalance. The fellow needs a decent woman in his life. But being what he is, he doesn't get any. <laughs> 